Hey, what's up gamers? It's AJ again from 1212 Games with another unboxing video for you. And in today's video, we're going to be unboxing the Collector's Edition of Valis for the Sega Genesis and Mega Drive. Alrighty. So looking at the front, you've got the title, Valis. This version of the game is not the original 1991 release, but is actually a special limited collector's edition re-release courtesy of Retrobit. And the cover image is taken directly from the original Japanese release and features the main character Yuko standing outside with some nice lovely trees or bushes surrounding her and the sky in the background. And then I'll flip it over to the spine and you can see the title again at the top along with the number one in gold at the bottom on a black background. This was actually part of a three game set that was released by Retrobit and includes all three Valis games that were released for the Sega Genesis. But if you get all three together, it spells out the word Valis in Japanese in the middle there. So that's pretty cool. And then I'll flip to the top. As you can see, this is a standard Genesis hard case which has a nice looking slip cover around it. And then I'll flip to the other side and you've just got the title on a black background. And then I'll flip to the bottom so you can see how this was sealed. And then looking at the back, at the bottom, you've got the Renovation Products logo. That was actually the publisher of the original 1991 version of the game. On the bottom right, you've got the Retrobit logo. And again, that was the publisher of this limited collector's edition re-release. And then you've also got a sticker on the back showing everything, including this embellished slipcover, a reversible cartridge sleeve that appears to include both the North American original artwork as well as the original Japanese artwork, a full-colored instruction manual, an individually numbered Certificate of Authenticity, a Valna Sapphire cartridge, that looks pretty cool, and some exclusive premium art cards. And then moving on down below that, you can see that this game is for one player. And then you can also see that this game works for both the North American Sega Genesis as well as the European Sega Mega Drive. So both systems, one cartridge. That is definitely awesome as well. So let's go ahead and unbox this. That's the back without the sticker. You can see you just got another image of Yuko just on a black background. And then it looks like the default side of the reversible cover is the original Japanese artwork. And there's that same cover image again from the slip cover. And it says Valis in Japanese, the legend of a phantasm soldier. And you got the Renovation Products logo again in the bottom left. And then on the spine, as Valis again in Japanese, The Legend of a Phantasm Soldier. Uh, it's got the retro bit at the bottom, as well as the Renovation Products logo at the top on a blue background. And then on the back, you've got another image of Yuko, and I believe that's the villain. And you got some more Japanese there. I only know how to read a little bit, so I have to skip that. And you got a nice looking screenshot there. And it says, Yuko Aso had just finished a long day at school when a freak storm began pouring rain, just like in her dream the night before. She then encounters her classmate Reiko, who leaves behind more questions than answers. Suddenly, set upon by a monster, Yuko manifests a sword in her hand, much to her surprise, and is able to defeat her foe. She tries to go home, but finds the entire city beset by demons. Armed with the Sword of Valis, Yuko must fight off the dark forces of King Rogals across seven action-packed stages 
and protect the Phantasm Jewel of Queen Valia. She will need to master the Mystic Blade as well as magic spells to defeat each one of Rogel's Dark Lords. Does she have it in her to save both worlds from the encroaching darkness? That's pretty cool. Nice. And then here is the Valna Sapphire transparent cartridge or translucent. That looks pretty awesome. You've got a black sticker label on the front with the title there outlined in gold. And you got the renovation products logo again. On the top, it just says Valis. Then on the back, you've got the typical cautions on a white sticker. And below that, you've got another black sticker with Yuko and the two publisher logos. And you can just make out on the chip inside that it says Valis in Japanese again. So that's really awesome looking. And then... We have the Certificate of Authenticity. You've got Yuko again, and the title in gold. And it says Collector's Edition, 16-bit game cartridge. And as you can see, this is number 1430 of 3500. And then it says Limited Production. you got the two publisher logos there again. And behind that, got the two art cards. Very cool. And then last but not least, you've got a game manual. And as you can see, you've got that same front cover image and it says Valis in Japanese, the Phantasm Soldier. And then on the back, it's got the publisher logos again on this sort of brown textured looking background. And then you've got a table of contents. And a little prologue that says the legend begins. Then you've got the cast. And starting up, controls, commands, screen indicators, recovery items. Weapon items, magic spells, stages, and it looks like you have it all again in Japanese. And that appears to be everything. And that'll do it. Hey, so I'd just like to thank you for checking out this unboxing of the collector's edition of Valis for the Sega Genesis and Mega Drive. If you enjoyed the video, please feel free to like, comment, and or subscribe. And you can also check out our website at 12-12games.com, which you can find down in the description.
Till the next time.